Given the brilliant start to his test career and the promise he held out, Surinder Amarnath's overall figures may be disappointing. But he was given a raw deal by the selectors. As the one classy left-hander in the side at the time, he could have been persevered with. Starting out as a schoolboy prodigy, his Ranji debut came when he was only 15 and made his mark first on the 1967 Indian Schoolboys Tour of England. Surinder continued to live up to this early potential by scoring a century on debut in an unofficial test against Sri Lanka in 1975 to 1976 and followed this up a few months later with a century on test debut in New Zealand. Surinder Amarnath debuted in Test Cricket against New Zealand at Auckland on 24 January 1976. An aggressive batsman, Surinder could be a bit flashy but when in full flow he was a treat to watch and could decimate even the best of attacks. He headed the averages in the two tests he played against England in 1976-1977 scoring two half-centuries in four innings but he was unfortunate to sustain an injury early on the tour of Australia in 1977-1978 and had to return home. However, he did reasonably well on the tour of Pakistan in 1978-1979 but was not considered again. This, despite getting 235 not out for Delhi against rest of India, in 1980-1981 following which there was a clamour for his inclusion in the team that went to Australia that season. A prolific run-getter in domestic cricket, Surinder scored 40-06 runs, 41.24, in the Ranji Trophy. His last test match was against Pakistan at Karachi on 14 November 1978. Surinder Amarnath debuted in ODI cricket against Pakistan at Quetta on 1 October 1978. His last ODI match was also against Pakistan at Sahiwal on 3 November 1978. Surinder Amarnath played 10 test matches, 18 innings, and scored 550 runs in his entire career with a decent batting average of 30.55. His highest score of 124 on debut against New Zealand at Auckland in 1976 helps India to win the match by 8 wickets. Interestingly this was his only century in international cricket. He hits one century and three half centuries along with one six in his entire test career. As a fielder, he took four catches. Surinder Amarnath also played three ODI matches, three innings, and scored 100 runs in his entire career with a decent batting average of 33.33. He had a very good ODI strike rate of 84.03. His highest ODI score of 62 against Pakistan at Sahiwal in 1978 was a controversial match. Captain Bishan Bedi conceded the match in protest against the short-pitched bowling tactics of Pakistan. Salfraz Nawaz's last four deliveries were all out of reach of the batsman and not called wide by the umpire. Surinder fails to hit any century and one half century in his entire ODI career. As a fielder, he took one catch. Surinder Amarnath's first-class record is up to the mark. The batting average is in the 40s with exactly at 40.47. He played 145 matches and scored 8,175 runs with the highest score of 235 not out. Overall he has 16 centuries in his kitty.